News at 9. Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Deborah Takahara. And I'm Ron Zapolo, a Colorado state lawmaker using a get out of jail free card after she stopped for suspected drunk driving. State Representative Laura Bradford, a Republican from Mesa County, has been suspended from her position as chair of the local government committee. Fox 31 Denver's Julie Hayden has our exclusive story. Bradford was pulled over near Colfax and Downing late Wednesday night, suspected of DUI. She told police she was coming from a legislative function and had another one to go to in the morning. Using key phrases that invoke a little-known section of the Colorado Constitution that gives lawmakers legislative immunity from arrest. State Representative Laura Bradford, a Republican from Mesa County, was stopped by Denver police suspected of drunk driving. It happened just after 10 p.m. Wednesday night near Colfax and Downing. The officer smelled an alcoholic beverage on her breath. Um, uh, she admitted to have been drinking. Police say she did not pass a roadside sobriety test. Did some roadside tests with the uh, legislator, uh, but because of state law and Denver police policy, um, they were unable to proceed further. Murray says if it had been a regular citizen, they would have been taken in for breath or blood tests, resulting in a possible DUI arrest. If a citizen failed roadside tests, uh, we would then go the next step and then take them to be tested for blood and breath. Article 5, Section 16 of the Colorado Constitution says during the legislative session, except in cases of treason or felony, Colorado lawmakers cannot be arrested during attendance at the session or committee meetings or going to and from the sessions or meetings. In other words, they have legislative immunity. Bradford released a statement saying, quote, I did not invoke legislative immunity, but police say Bradford is the one who specifically mentioned she was coming from and going to a legislative function. Police say those words tied their hands. They could not continue their DUI investigation and could only give her a lane violation traffic ticket and a cab. If a state legislator says that they are coming to or, or going from a legislative session, um, that you're not to detain them. Legal experts say using the Constitution to avoid a DUI arrest is clearly not the intent of the law. It clearly was not to protect people that were accused of drunk driving. It was meant to make sure that for political reasons, a legislator was not in jail or in prison and therefore unable to go to an important vote or some kind of legislative session. Sources say Bradford was seen drinking at the Prohibition Bar just down the street as early as 7 o'clock that night. Now in her statement she also said that she strongly believes she should be held to the same standard as everyone else. A police say she didn't say that to them that night and if she had she would have been taken in for a blood or breath test and given a DUI if that's what she deserved. In Denver, Julie Hayden, Fox 3. Denver. We want to know what you think about this story. Just go to our Facebook page and share your comments. It's facebook.com slash Fox 31 Denver. The Denver police officers involved in the death of a man at the Denver Zoo will not face any discipline stemming from the case. That decision from the city's new manager of safety who issued his final report on the incident.